Hey guys, welcome back to Forever After X, or AKA I'm Nick. Uh, we're gonna be checking out Spirit Box, the Mara Effect, live at the Silverside Sound. And uh, yeah, to what I know, that there are three parts of the song, which I have not heard any of them yet, but this was requested. I should have brought that up actually, so I could have said your name. Uh, but uh, I have had a couple people uh, mention this song that I need to check it out, and now I'm getting around to it, so here we go. Oh, also, if you guys do like this content, I'm almost to 100 subscribers. I'm like, uh, I think like 19 or 18 short as of as I'm recording this video. So, uh, yeah, you know, uh, I've been doing this for around three months now, and uh, I really love all you guys' love and support, and uh, it helps me out a lot, and I appreciate it. It makes me feel good, so, yeah. So I absolutely love the guitar tone that I'm hearing. I think they said his name is Mike because I think that is her husband. I think. Not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure you guys have said that they are actually married. So that's pretty sick. Whatever they did, uh, like post wise to her vocals right there, they sound incredible for live performance and everything, for all the the reverb delay and whatever else they put on that, it sounds incredible. <laughs> Bless me.
How often have they uh, done guitar solos? Because I think I've listened to maybe five or six of their songs, and I have not seen one yet. So awesome. Did not know he had those kind of chops on the fingers. So this is going to be part two. Uh, I'm sure somebody knows, uh, but what is the um, the correlation between part one, two, and three? Is this like one long story, or is there? I don't. I don't even know what the Mara effect is. If that even is a real thing, I have no idea. But if you guys could let me know, that'd be much appreciated. <laughs> That totally changed uh, everything. I that time signature sounded a little bit weird too about how he was hitting the uh, little crash. This sounded a little uh, a little off time signature, so I like it. Yeah, hundred percent. Yeah, they're t they're totally changing some stuff up because this that ain't right. That kick sounds beautiful too, right in my ear. Oh yeah. Arms are like serpents 
cannot follow that at all. Like, I have no idea how you even play that switching time signatures, like, so often. It's freaking nuts. I don't know if this is part three yet or not, but thus far, like, these songs have been, like, I mean, nothing, like, spectacular or anything like that, but, like, they've just been so, like, good, where you could just sit, relax, and listen to it and just have a good time because there hasn't been that many screams. So, like, like catchiness-wise, like, these have been really good songs. There's a lot of cleans, surprisingly. I like it. That's juicy. I needed that. That put me into a better mood. Because my last video I just did got blocked. So this put me into a better mood. That was good. That was nice. That was the end of the song, Jim, of part two. Literally, juicy is, the, is just that word. That is the perfect word to describe the ending of the song. Juicy. If you would uh, like show this to your friends, you would not expect her to be a metal screamer at all. 
like this would be a perfect video to show them and then show them some like off rule of nines or something where she just goes absolutely nuts. Yeah, I still, I've said it once before, the the effects they're putting, whenever she starts screaming, I would love to know what it is because I would like to hear what it would sound like if I would do with it because that's, that's, that sounds amazing. Everything about it, everything about it. Yeah. 
Oh, I was honestly about to get scared because I thought they were about to just do another thing of screaming right there because I thought he was lowering the tuning of his guitar. Oh, man, that's just completed the trifecta of the Mara effect. Uh, I would definitely have to check out uh, the like album versions of all three of them. What uh, What's your favorite? Because out of that, I think uh, part two would be my favorite if it is just called part two. Yeah, that's probably my favorite just because... Uh, well, everything, but that ending, again, being so juicy, that, uh, yeah, definitely, definitely some good stuff. This is uh, going to be another really long video. Yesterday's video was over 30 minutes long, and this is probably going to be over, uh, I don't know, like 22, maybe, I don't know. It was so good. I'm so glad you guys have mentioned that to me. Uh, again, I've mentioned this on pretty much all of my uh, Spirit Box videos that I'm going to have my mom come and watch the one-take version of The Rule of Nines. I'm pretty sure that's the song that I chose. But she's going to check that out because she doesn't listen to this kind of music at all. So hopefully to get a good uh, reaction from her. So that'll be fun. Yeah. Again, guys, I'm approaching 100 subscribers. Maybe if you guys could help me out, that'll be so, so helpful. If not, hey, you know, that's not a big deal. You know, I can't make you guys do anything. I'm trying to put out some good content for you guys and uh, listen to recommendations that you guys give me. And this was one of them. So appreciate it big time. If I wasn't doing this YouTube channel, I probably would not know about Spirit Box. So, yeah, there's that. Yep, 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 yep. All right, guys, I am Forever After Reacts, a.k.a. Nick, and I hope you guys have a good day.